Hallihallo meine lieben Zuschauer und herzlich willkommen zu einer neuen Folge zu Fire Emblem Engage. Wenn euch das Video gefällt, dann lasst ein Abo und ein Like da und ich wünsche euch jetzt viel Spaß mit dem Video. Ja moin Leute ne? und herzlich willkommen zurück zu Fire Emblem Engage. Ja, beim letzten Mal haben wir gegen Timera und äh, Ivy gekämpft, also gegen beide Länder haben gelernt. Beide Länder bestehen nur aus Verzerrten, genau genommen alle. Und Nil ist offenbar der Böse. Das hätte ich tatsächlich nicht gedacht. Naja, wie das aber jetzt weitergehen wird, das sehen wir gleich. Ich bin jetzt extra hier im Hauptmenü, damit ich nicht aus Versehen die äh, Story trigger. Ich habe aber abgespeichert. Deswegen weiß ich, dass danach auch die Story direkt getriggert wird, also Kapitel 5. Und ich würde einfach mal sagen... Ihr genießt jetzt noch kurz die Bandgespräche, Unterstützungsgespräche etc. Über mir ist ein Zeitstempel, wenn ihr die überspringen wollt. Und wir sehen uns dann gleich in Kapitel 5 wieder. Hey Nell, how are you feeling? Having any trouble adjusting or anything? I have had no difficulty. And I feel the same as I felt prior to my slumber. I'm glad to hear that. All the same, I hope you'll come to me if there's anything you need. Before we arrived here, Rafal informed me of the circumstances which allowed me to awaken. You had a notion of how to wake me, but you could not be assured of success. And yet you pondered whether I would come, as if to take that success as given. Why? You're right, I didn't know for sure. I guess I just believed it. Explain. I chose to have faith that we'd meet again now, no matter how long it took. I see. You truly are possessed of a virtuous nature, Divine One. I only hope that your gentle disposition does not cause you to trust others unduly. Farewell. <laughs> I guess I should be used to the lectures by now. Even so, it's good to see her in high spirits. Never change now. Sizzle and crackle on the heat. Nothing tastes better than roasting me. Yeah! You are not easy to find, little princess. Uh, lady, no! I wish to discuss the food you have been leaving in front of me. Guess there's no point hiding it. Yeah, that was me. Lately, you just look so tired. Whenever I walk past you, there you are, sleeping on the ground. <sighs> I figured a good strong meal would put some pet back in your step. Forgive me. It seems that my recent outdoor naps have caused you to worry. The concern is appreciated, but I still do not understand what role the meat is meant to play. Food gives you energy, right? So, more food, more energy. Perhaps that is true for your kind. But such things fail to put a pep in my step, as you say. So, if that is your intention, I would recommend an alternative approach. Whoa! I didn't even think of trying something else. Got any ideas? Hit me. I rather enjoyed the song you were singing earlier. Perhaps you could continue that. Ooh, sure. Which one? Facing snack words? Meat on the wind? Bacon in my heart? I did not realize there were so many. I am uncertain of the title. The choice is yours. I can't believe you actually want to hear me sing! My time has finally come! <laughs> you know, I can't decide. Why don't I just sing them all for you? I would appreciate that. Well, well. If it isn't Fogato, my one and only Sibby. <laughs> <laughs> yes, in the flesh. Care to tell me why you're in such a good mood? No reason in particular. Really? I would have guessed there was a song or a slab of meat involved. Mind, I'm glad to see you looking so cheery. Always puts a smile on my face. Well, good, because I'm happy as can be. But I'm going to have to insist you tell me why. Come on, Sibby to Sibby. If you really want to know, it's because you're here, duh. Is that all? I'm always here. Oh, hate to break it to you, but no. I'll admit, back in Solm, I didn't spend all that much time in the castle. But you? You were never around. 
I hardly spent time with you at all. Huh. Yeah. You make a good point. These aren't what you'd call the best circumstances, but I'm glad I see you every day. Wow. You really put a positive spin on things. We're in the middle of a war, and you make it sound like a family vacation. Got a problem with that? Not one bit. As I said, I'm just happy that you're happy. Lady Vale, I wanted to make up for our last encounter. I brought you a gift. A gift? Thank you, Gregory. What is it? <laughs> well, I asked around and was told that you like spicy things, so I went into town and got you the spiciest treats I could find. Shall we try them together? You really went to all that trouble for me? If it's worth doing something, it's worth doing it right. Please. If something looks tasty, dig in. <sighs> He's always so kind. And yet, although I know he isn't Chris, I'm still nervous around him. Hmm? What's wrong? Do you feel awkward eating alone? All right, then. I'll eat something, too. This bright red sandwich thing looks pretty good. Careful. That one looks extremely spicy. <laughs> hmm. Not as spicy as I thought. Although, wait. Oh no. Is this a delayed heat? Yeah! Hot! Hot! Yeah! Oh no! I'll get you some water! <coughs> I'm fine, really. <coughs> Don't worry about me. Please, try one of the treats. Uh, are you sure? Well, if you insist, I guess I'll try the same one. Oh, wow. This is delicious. I've never had this before, but it's just spicy enough. Seriously? This isn't too spicy for you? Wow. I'm glad I made you smile, at least. There's still plenty left. <laughs> Please help yourself. Um, you're sweating. Are you feeling okay? That might have been a bit too spicy. <sighs> Guess I'm not as tolerant to that sort of pain as you. <laughs> but I'm fine. Really, I can handle. Gregory? Gregory! What do I do? I just fell over. I'll, I'll go get some help. Just don't move. Oh, why would you push yourself like that? Oh. <sighs> That should be enough training for one day. I've worked up quite a sweat. That was quite the training session. You must be tired. This world hasn't changed you at all. How are you liking it here anyway? Now that I've built a rapport with everyone, this place is starting to feel like a home. How are you finding it? Me? It's not bad. It was a bit of a shock making all these new friends at once, though. I'd never really spent much time with others besides us four winds. But I'll get used to it. Yes, it's certainly bustling. Reminds me a little of my hometown. Home? We never really talk about it. What was your family like? Well, my home life was happy. My parents were knights, and I always looked up to them. I know they loved me very much. That's why I became a knight. To make them proud. Love, huh? I'm almost a little jealous. What do you mean? Well... Growing up with loving parents sounds like a blessing. Not everyone gets to be loved growing up. Then again, not everyone is capable of loving. Hmm. I feel as if we're not talking about me anymore. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to... Uh, don't mind me. You must be exhausted after your training. I didn't mean to bother you. We can chat later. Very well. Take care, Gregory. I really appreciated your help in that last battle, Gregory. I will be relying on you more often. That's kind of you to say, but don't get too used to it. I might end up disappointing you. Fram, that food you're always carrying around, what is it? Beets! They're super duper nutritious, 
And they're my very favorite. I try to remove as many enemy units as I can, no matter the cost. If all else fails, we flee. You really enjoy battle, huh? I guess we don't have as much in common as I thought. I'd like to know more about you, Lady Edelgard. What kind of people were your parents? Mother passed away when I was very young. Father was kind. Too kind for an emperor. Will you defy fate, brush off despair, and forge bonds with your allies? Will your other half remain by your side? The kings and queens have vanished like melted snow, like wind-swept sand. Who remains? A familiar stranger. A loved one whose name you don't know. One knows the truth. In this world, there is no emptiness. Your dream will not come true. Lady Nell isn't coming out, is she? Sitting alone under a tree, not saying a word? Never seen her withdraw like this before. She has been there for half an hour. Perhaps we should offer our aid. Mavir, you really don't understand the tenderness of the heart, do you? I... I... I do not follow. Lady Nell just revealed her innermost feelings. A love she has kept concealed for years. It's only natural she might need some time to herself after that. Ah, I see. People's hearts are fragile when they're in love. You gotta be gentle with them, big guy. Sounds like you speak from experience, Gregory. Have you been in love before? Nope. But I hear it's as terrifying as it is exhilarating. You? Me? Uh, uh, well, I, uh... Hmm? What was the question? I hate leaving Lord Nil and the Divine Dragon alone for this long. But she needs time. If only there was some way to reunite Lady Nell with her love. We all know how deeply she cared for the Divine Dragon. Yeah, but that was the other Divine Dragon, not this one. You think I don't know that? I just... want to see Lady Nell happy. She deserves every happiness. Yes, a loyal attendant always wants the best for their liege. That I can comprehend, even if the tenderness of the heart is beyond my grasp. I'm glad you understand. And I hope you all know I care about you just as much as I do her. I want us to stick together and keep each other safe. Thank you all for giving me that space. Please, Lady Nell, think nothing of it. You feeling better? Very much. Thank you for giving me the time to reflect. I suppose I never fully dealt with the loss of the one I loved so dearly. But I deeply regret the trouble I caused. I should have told you about the corrupted royals. You are my trusted confidants, and I should have known to rely upon you. You honor us, Lady Nil. No doubt Lord Nil would also be comforted by those words. Of course. I owe the Divine Dragon an apology as well. My behavior has been frightfully rude. I hope we will be able to begin anew as friends. I think that's a great idea. Let's hurry back to the others. They must be tired of waiting. I will meet you properly this time, Divine One. I will finally set aside my grief for the one I lost, and see you for the person you truly are. Here we are. Divine One? Nil? That's strange. There's no one here. Are we in the wrong place? I don't believe so. We walked the right direction, and I remember the scenery from earlier. I hate to raise the possibility, but there may have been an ambush. Sister! 
Everyone! Oh, I'm so glad you're back. Nell, what a relief to see you safe. We have a problem. The bracelets are gone. Gone? How? The Divine Dragon took them and left. I fear the plan is to finish this alone. Then we must begin our pursuit at once. I managed to cast a simple tracking spell before we parted. The trail should still be active. I regret that I lacked the courage to give chase. In truth, I feared being separated from you all. I hope you can forgive my cowardice. There is nothing to forgive, Nil. You made a wise decision. If you can show us the way, please do. Of course. This dire state of affairs is entirely my fault. <clears throat> We have now crossed into Solm. I cannot begin to fathom the Divine Dragon's objective. It is very close. In fact, the trail of my spell ends right here. Some kind of temple. Let us enter. It is dim in here. Watch your step. You are certain this is where the Divine Dragon is now? Reasonably certain. <gasps> Behind you! Corrupted? Oh boy. A lot of them, too. We will take them on. Stay behind me, Nil. <laughs> Nil? Your consideration is appreciated, dear sister. But I do not require your protection. I confess. I always rather despised that about you. Your superiority. Your condescension. What? <laughs> the look on your face. Wake up, Nell. The Divine Dragon is not here. Explain what you mean by this. Lord Nil, are the corrupted here your doing? No. It was a mistake, surely. Lord Nil didn't know where he was taking us. Is that what you think? Perhaps this will change your mind. Emblem Krom. He should be in slumber. Must I spell it out? Your unknown malefactor has the power to awaken emblems. And here he stands before you. I am no powerless failure. I will fulfill the late Lord Sombron's ambitions. But you are my brother. We have always been together. Two halves of a whole, you cannot be our enemy. Who else could it be? There is no one left. All of our siblings are dead and gone. I dispensed with the lot of them myself. With one exception, of course. <sighs> Has it all become clear to you? Good. Farewell then, my dear sister. Enjoy being buried with your four little breezes. I am off to sink my teeth into your darling divine dragon. Nell, how could you? Lady Nell, please. We must focus. None of this makes any sense. But the Corrupted won't wait for us to figure it out. They are many, but we are strong. Once I transform... Nell has my dragon stone. And while we are cornered here, the Divine Dragon is in grave danger. Lady Nell, leave this to us. No, Celestia. We may not all make it out of this, but the four of us can create an opening for you to escape. Quickly, you must get away from this place. Go to the Divine Dragon! No, I will not leave you here. Celestia is right. You have to go. You are the only one who can stop Lord Nil. We've always been the ones running away. Let us be heroes for once. It'll be an honor to ensure your safe passage. Now, Lady Nell, hurry! 
Farewell, my dear four winds. Hear me and obey. Survive until we meet again. That is an order. We won't let you down. <laughs> Here I am, Divine One. Nil. My dear sister and her precious four winds have now been dealt with. No. Well, if that's true, you should just kill me. But I don't think you have it in you. You're wrong about that. But you still have a part to play in this. Come along now. I'm not going anywhere with you. Is that right? You said I have a part to play. What if I refuse to cooperate? I won't do anything that helps you win. <gasps> How can you be so cruel? Does the love of my sweet sister mean nothing to you at all? I'd already begun to think of you as family. You've cut me to the quick. You can stop your lies now. <laughs> nothing escapes your notice. But if you intend to resist, I can simply force you. Do your worst. I won't give in. I suppose there is only one way to know. Shall we find out together? <sighs> Nell? How? Divine One, you are alive. Nell! You actually left the Four Winds to die? I ought to have seen that coming. Nell! Stop this at once. Father is dead. There is no longer any need to carry out his wishes. I know his ambitions are not your own. It is meaningless for us to fight. Meaningless? You know absolutely nothing of my ambitions. Come forth, my corrupted. But there... The assassins from Lethos Castle. That attack was your doing all along. Of course. You dared mock our Lord Father's ambitions. It was my duty to kill you, failure. Enough. Take up your weapon. See for yourself whether this fight has meaning. This is not who you are, Nil. Was denkt sich Nil über diese Aktion? War doch vollkommen unnötig von ihm. Okay, meine Truppen, also meine Originaltruppen stehen hier oben, die, die ich nehmen darf. Ich darf diesmal viele nehmen. Die stehen beieinander. Wahrscheinlich wird es hauptsächlich ein Kampf zwischen Nell und Nil. Also hier steht einmal Hortensia und Fogado. Also lag ich nicht falsch damit, äh, wer da im ersten... DLC-Kapitel vor mir stand. Aber vom Prinzip her brauche ich mich ja eigentlich nur auf äh, Nil zu konzentrieren. Na gut, aber ich muss jetzt trotzdem erstmal Truppen anpassen. Also wir sehen uns in ein paar Minuten bei mir, ein paar Sekunden bei euch. Ihr wisst den Drill. Jo Leute, meine Truppen sind angepasst. Ich bin bereit für den Krieg. Ich habe wieder Hortensia, Ivy, Fogado, Timera für die beiden da drüben äh, im Petto. Der wird sich 100 pro wahrscheinlich wegteleportieren. Für den Fall, dass äh, jetzt nochmal eine Sequenz kommt, packe ich mich nochmal aus dem Bild. Und ich konnte übrigens weder mein Inventar noch das von Nil anpassen. Also, hier seht ihr es nochmal. Na dann, let's go. Hold still, Divine One. I want you to watch each of your allies perish. Okay. Kann sich auch nicht bewegen. Okay. Ich muss mit Purgativ dann da arbeiten. Der ein oder andere von meinen äh, Heilern hat Purgativ dabei. Also ich muss da jetzt so schnell wie möglich hin. Die Kisten, äh, die interessieren mich, glaube ich, eher weniger, weil es ist egal, was da drin ist. Ich kann es so oder so nicht mitnehmen. 
Es wäre nur für diese Schlacht eventuell nützlich. Ciao. So, dich richtig hin. Ach, Louis, mein gepanzerter General, den, den niemand down bekommt. Bestimmt kommen die vier Winde noch nach. So, ich habe einen Langbogen. So, dann gibt es ja jetzt nur noch eine Sache zu tun. Oh, bei ihr kann ich mir aussuchen, welche Ader. Ist ja mal richtig geil. Korn ist perfekt für die. Ich mach mal die Flammenader. Divine one. So sorry that we were interrupted earlier. If you'd rather not fight, all you have to do is agree to come with me. Let me guess. You want me to turn over the six bracelets too. Since you have the seventh, I'm sure you're eager to finish your collection. That's not happening. I'll stop you here. I am sure I would say the same in your position. Ah, <sighs> how tedious. I tire of these games, Divine One. Since you are Father's most hated enemy, I will simply take what I need and then destroy you. We do not have to fight, Nil. There is still time. Time for what? Talk? We are well past that. Do you expect me to simply abandon my plans and surrender? Go back to being a failure? We can resolve this. Explain your plans to me. Help me understand. Ich würde sie auch gern verstehen. Power and to kill you. That is all you need to know before you die. Daneben. Ja, dagegen war ich schon gewappnet. Böse? Ja, sicher. So, mit teleport ne, könnte ich doch darüber und ihr helfen, oder nicht? Ich mache nicht mal ansatzweise Schaden. So viel dazu. So, hier jetzt einmal den Speer machen. Oh, ich habe wieder Sandsturm endlich. Ich habe gar nicht gemerkt, dass ich den wieder habe. So, jetzt verschwinden. So, ich mache mal die Nebelader am besten. Dann trifft er weniger. So, ich mach mal die Nebeladel und dann hat er schwerer mit dem Treffen. Was genau muss ich denn tun, äh, um da oben zu befreien? Ich hau dir einfach mal direkt eine runter. Du kannst dich eh nicht wehren. Louis ist komplett alleine unten. Der kommt da schon klar. Machen wir doch mal was Lustiges. Weg mit dir. So, dich vernichte ich. Oh, yeah. I will 
Dich mach ich weg. Du heilst ihn nicht mehr. Ich kann hier leider nicht sonderlich viel machen. Was muss ich denn tun, um mich zu befreien? Ich glaube, ich muss wirklich äh, hier die verzerrten äh, Infogado und Hortensia vernichten, um mich da rauszuholen. Ja, wenigstens kann ich endlich mal angreifen. Ich frage mich, warum sich hier keiner bewegt. So, einmal hier ein Echo. Kann ja hier zweimal angreifen. Das ist mein Speer. Ein Rüstprojektil. Will ich wissen, was das macht? Du kannst mich zum Schweigen bringen. Der nutzt eh keine Magie. Okay, das ist fies. Die anderen alle können mir egal sein, aber der Magier, der ist fies. Sounds fun. I want to get in on the killing. I guess I'll need some pawns. You're not going anywhere. <lacht> Ich glaube, ich lasse am besten einen Heiler da oben. Hier muss ich mit Magie arbeiten. Die Bl äh, reflektieren physischen Schaden. So, dann gehe ich mal direkt auf mehr Magie. Muss ihn ja so töten. So, mit Seraphim kann ich dich umnieten und dem anderen kann ich dann noch den Elfendonner geben. Beziehungsweise, er kriegt jetzt nochmal einen Blitz ab. Durch Thoron. Seraphim kann ich sogar drei Felder weit schießen. Warum auch immer. Oh, das ist noch besser. Ich beschwere mich nicht. Ja komm, ich plündere mal eine Kiste. Purgativ. Weg mit dir. Einfrieren. Ja, da kannst du ruhig hinschießen. Diese Kanoniere sind irgendwie das Lämste. Die treffen überhaupt nicht. Ach, hör auf. Ich mache mal was Sinnvolles. Fogado? Astra Sturm. Um Gottes Willen, wie viel Abwehr hast du? Ich würde dir nur 5 Schaden machen. Ist ja abnormal. 
Okay, dann lohnt sich der Astersturm da gar nicht. Aber vielleicht können wir machen, dass er sich anderweitig lohnt. Ja, ich kann hier den Weg räumen, dann kann ich den Magier ausschalten. Der Magier, der stört gerade massiv. Dann nutze ich auch den Zwillingsschlag. Das ist der einzige dort, der Louis gefährlich ist. Toron auf dich mal bitte. Dann schalte ich den Kanonier dort aus. Sayonara. Und noch ein Kanonier. Zum Glück haben die den Aim vor dem Sturmtruppler. Erneuerung. Daneben. Au. Das erste Mal, dass die getroffen haben. Tschüss. Ich erinnere mich an die Wölfe. Macht er das jetzt jede Runde mit äh, Viecher beschwören? Ja, macht er. Sayonara! You have my respect. Einer weniger. Danke für die AP. Why do we repeat our mistakes? Weg. Me first. I hope I've done well. So, du juckst mich nicht die Bohne. I will protect everyone. Die Bahn ist frei. Zeit, die Wölfe zu vernichten. Was macht denn zupackende Leere? Ach, wie Sandsturm, okay. Los, Tomahawk, flieg! Oh, die Beistandsader, die ich genutzt habe, die heilt auch ihn. Dieser Wuffi. Watch out for my corrupted wyverns. They are so very eager to tear your divine. Ach, bieb dich. In dein Gesicht. So was nennt man Overkill? Einfach fünfmal äh, von den Verbündeten ins Gesicht. Ist mein Speer. Danke für den Heal. Zeit für einen gut getimten... Tomahawk. So, dann direkt den nächsten über den Haufen prügeln. Kennt du schon Excalibur? So, Toron auf dich. 
Uff. Ich habe da vorne Elfie aktiviert. Es ist übrigens merkwürdig, wenn ich nur Ahnung nutze, dann greift er nur einmal an. Ja, das kommt mir gelegen, dass du angreifst. Das ist Mist. Dem Dieb habe ich den Weg versperrt. Ja genau, greift äh, 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 bzw. Diamant an. Greift ihn an. Es wird ein schönes A4. So, die Ecke hier unten ist dann gleich geklärt. Das ist einfach noch ein Kackweifern. Schaden ohne Ende! So, dich kann ich aus dem Weg räumen und den Kanonier kann Louis auch alleine schaffen, eigentlich. Problem ist eher der Beifern. Ich schieße ich von Haufen. Die Jagd ist eröffnet. Ja, beide gefährliche Waffen. So, dich auch direkt weg. Tschüss. Langsam ist der Weg frei. Da ist Fogado. Ne, dass Fogado zu mir runterkommt. Du bist ein Fiesling. Du bist weg. You'll get no sympathy from me. So, einmal auf Fogado schießen. Mit Fogado. Hey, me. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm you. Huh. That's exactly what I would have said. You really are me. I'd be lying if I said this wasn't a dream come true, but it's not to be. You're too... villainy. Oh, I know. I'm a real piece of work. In fact... That hooded assassin at Lethos? It was me! And since I'm such a bad guy, I think I'll kill you and take your place in that other world. But look on the bright side. The last thing you see will be your own handsome face. Ach, sehr ruhig. I'm here. <lacht> so, dann gucke ich mal, was in dieser Kiste drin ist. Eine Stärkung. Jetzt gebe ich dir eins auf die Mütze. Ich habe Fogado jetzt gerade mal extra leben lassen, weil ich noch mit äh, Timera auf ihn hauen will. Mit mir selber werde ich nicht dazu kommen.
Ekelhaftes Mistvieh. Der Dieb kann ruhig abhauen, der ist mir so Wumpe. So, Fogado. Jetzt kriegst du von deiner Schwester eins auf die Nase. Tamara? You're not supposed to be here. Yeah. I can see how this would be confusing. Got that right. Last I heard, Nell eat you. That wasn't me. That was your real city. I'm actually from another world. Ah, thanks for clearing that up. You know, I was upset that I didn't get to do the honors. I always hoped that I'd be the one who killed my sister. Guess I'll have to settle for killing her lookalike instead. My Hank. Und tschüss, Fogado. I'm here. Now that was fun. Whoops. Guess I lost. How many times is that now? So einfach Toron hier wirken. Das passt schon. So, let's go. Ich hatte jetzt extra nicht angegriffen für den Fall, dass äh, Hortensia runterkommt. Ich will nicht, dass sie geschädigt wird. Zumindest nicht, bevor ich mit den entsprechenden Charakteren angreifen konnte. Mich kriegst du nicht kaputt. Ich will mich reizhusten. So, ich werde dich einfach äh, mal eben kurz mit Beugern an los, ne? Einer weniger. So, ich nutze einfach Toron. Ihr Runenschwert ist mir offenbar gefährlich. Okay, dann mache ich mal noch äh, hier Elfendonner. Hat nicht unrecht. But Ivy told me the truth. We're the most miserable wretches alive. So, Bündnis überreiten. Ich werde ich jetzt los. Hortensia kann ich mit Fogado finishen. Der ist dann jetzt auch aus dem Weg. So. Tschüss, Hortensia. Ruhe in Frieden. Ich 
compared to fathers. So, sie sind alle Rip. Was machst du jetzt? Böse. Weg mit dem Kanonier. So, jetzt hast du ein schlechtes Spiel vor dir. Du bist als nächster Tod. So, den Schild hinter dir vernichte ich mal. Hast keine Protektion verdient. Come to kill me, have you? But I thought we were friends. Halt die Klappe. Wie mache ich dir denn anständig Schaden, ist die Frage. Es wäre gut, wenn ich ihn hier reinlocken würde, dann könnte ich mit allen ihn angreifen. So, ich habe gehört, ein Leben nehme ich dir jetzt gleich. Jetzt kann ich den Aster Sturm ja ruhig nutzen. Er so verdammt viel aus. So, einmal Toron. Ich muss ihm über die Koop-Schläge verprügeln. Dann noch mal ein paar Koop-Schläge. Das ist die einzige Art, wie ich Schaden mache. So, ich nutze das Echo aus, um noch mehr Koop-Schläge zu verteilen. So, einmal noch. Fallen hier oben. Alter, das hat so lang gedauert. Nell, you saved me. I could not bear to lose you. Please, allow me to apologize for the manner in which I have treated you. It was unforgivable. In my weakness, I failed to accept that you are not the same divine dragon as the one I lost. I understand that clearly now. And if you would allow it, I would like to begin again as friends. I'd like that too. Thank you, Divine One. Do you think Nell is all right? He is merely unconscious. But let us reclaim the bracelet while we have the opportunity. The bracelet of the Shepherd Exalt. The only one we had from the start at Lethos Castle. I never imagined that we would be forced to do battle with you, Hemplum Krom. I knew you would triumph. The darkest futures still have hope. May you both cherish your new bond. We will. Let us make haste to the Four Winds. <laughs> uh, 
there's so many of them. Yes. Every time we defeat one, another appears. We cannot sustain this for much longer. We can take shelter behind that altar and escape them for a moment. Follow me! <sighs> Phew! Finally! A chance to catch our breath. Not for long. The enemy will break through in time. What do we do? There's also only one exit, and it's blocked by a sigil calling forth more corrupted. You mean, we're trapped? Indeed. Trapped in a temple full of the corrupted. It's fortunate we got Lady Nell out when we did. She could have been stuck in here too. But as much as I hate to say it, there appears to be no escape for us. We probably won't survive. <sighs> I have a plan. You do? I mean, great! That's just what I'd expect from our second in command. A plan to sacrifice our lives to take out as many of the corrupted as we can. What?! Good enough. Let's hear it. We can only do so much fighting individually, but what if we could crush them all at once? We can head to the four corners of the temple and knock down the pillars holding it up. That will destroy the temple and all of the corrupted inside. Hmm. If all goes well, we will also prevent them from pursuing Lady Nell and the Divine Dragon. But... And I just want to be clear. We all get flattened, right? Correct. I approve. If all the roads lead to death, let's at least take the one that brings those creatures with us. It would appear this is our best option. Count me in. But... <sighs> yeah. I'll do it. You are all certain about this? At least we're going together, right? No one has to face the end alone. <laughs> Gregory, it will probably hurt a bit. Yeah, I think so. But it's fine. If I remind myself this is the last pain I'll ever feel, I can bear it. I mean, I, I probably can. Yeah, I can. Madeline, you are still so young in years. Perhaps there is a way for me to destroy two pillars, so you have a chance to escape. Why? Are you afraid I won't be up to the task on my own? No, not at all. Then I reject your proposal. I want to share my fellow Wind's fate, whatever that may be. Besides, your plan depends on us destroying the four pillars at the same time. I urge you, do not make this sacrifice just to be known as a hero. The dead do not hear praise. I know. My mentor taught me that what's important is not praise, but what one achieves. And above all, living a life one can be proud of. You really have grown into a splendid knight. Hearing you say that, I can face whatever comes next. Well, friends, looks like our time's up. I'm glad we got this final chance to be together. I love you all. Now, let's destroy them! Lady Nell, this is as far as we go. Forgive us for not obeying your command to live. I hope you and the Divine Dragon find a way to save Lord Nil. And live in happiness. Listen up, Four Winds. This is our final mission. Break the pillars! What was that? I heard something. My winds. No. <laughs> <laughs> Nil. My corrupted have performed better than I could have hoped. The temple has collapsed. And unless my senses have failed me, nothing within the rubble survives. The four winds are no more. No! How did this happen? We were deceived. The four winds and I were attacked by the corrupted inside that temple. They remained behind so that I could escape and make my way to you. No! 
You refused to cooperate with me earlier, Divine One. Perhaps this will force your hand. No! If you value her life, you will meet me on the island that once floated among the clouds. Nil, stop! <sighs> what do I do? An island that was in the clouds. It has been some time since those twins betrayed me. Soon, my foe will strike me down. Perhaps I will deliver a killing blow in turn. It matters not. All is in motion. My child will realize my desires. Meanwhile, the divine dragon will die childless. With no heir and no legacy, the fool. My pawns move as I will them to, without hesitation. But I wonder, how long will that son of mine keep up this ruse of being Nell's twin? After all, her real twin is no more. That failure died long ago. Okay, Leute, das war eine harte Schlacht. Ich muss mich wirklich massiv durchprügeln, aber hab's am Ende geschafft. Beim nächsten Mal haben wir das Finale vom DSC vor uns und damit auch das Finale vom Spiel an sich. Dann werden wir nämlich ins gefallene Somnil reisen, der Dämonenwelt 6 und Nil in den Arsch treten. Naja, nichtsdestotrotz. Ich hoffe, ihr hattet alle Spaß beim Zusehen. Wenn ja, ein Abo und ein Like da lassen. Und wir sehen uns beim nächsten Mal wieder. Ciao, Leute!